right, Piney Comics, John back with you again with Mitch Halleck of the uh, Terrific, Terrific Con, Terrific Con. August 9th to the 11th. 9th to the 11th. It is, it is truly uh, an awesome, fantastic show. It yeah. is so comic uh, centric. It is. You're going to want to cut burn it your open guts and out. you bleed so, Neil Adams. Yeah. Neil, a who, yeah, Neil Adams. He'll be there. You've got, have uh, you yeah. have uh, J. Michael Straczynski coming, right? Oh, oh my God. Right? I have J. Michael Straczynski come, Neil Adams, Tom King, Donnie Cates, Ryan Stegman, Jerry Ordway. Uh, like 150 guests. Yeah, and then it's you a got real Comic Con. It's none of that nonsense where I get the cast of like Facts of Life there. Ooh, oh, you got hey, hey, hey. what's what, our Comic Con? What's your problem I'm with Joe? Uh, what's her name? I'm right? uh, Joey yeah. and uh, Tootie. That's it's great Tootie. if you like that, but don't call yourself a Comic Con, all right? What's call yourself a words. TV Con. But I will say this: call yourself a Pop Con. You do get some. I guess, get some actors. This year you're going to have be a great Sal Kilmer there, right? I got Batman. I got uh, Doc Holliday. Yeah. Doc Holliday. Yeah, Doc Holliday, very famous in Tombstone. And, and um, Jim Morrison in The Doors. That's right. And you got, you got freaking Lando Calrissian. I got Calrissi. John Barrowman, oh, the coolest guy in the galaxy. That's right. Works every time. Lando Calrissian <laughs> saved us from the second Death Star. He did. In a galaxy far, did. far away. You, did you ever know? You're a super. We're gonna talk Star Wars in a minute. You're a really big Star Wars fan. Hell yeah. I never realized until I saw the episode. He stole of, Han Solo's clothes. Why is he wearing Han's clothes? Because he left his other ship back in Cloud City. They're, they're and they're in he the, had to get something to put on. They're it. in it a Rebel that. frigate. There's got to be some other uniform. Okay. okay. So remember, the Falcon was his first. So it was, it might have been Han stole his stole clothes. His Han's clothes. wearing his oh, clothes. Oh, you ever think of that? Yeah. I never thought that. Why is it so tight in the crowd? But after seeing Solo, I. I refuse See? to believe that because he, he he wore lavish yellow Ooh. capes. You and know all what fucks me about and, Dennis Solo? And Ham is very much. He's got a little yellow a shirt with these little sailboats on it, like you got at JC Penney. Yeah. I'm like, where'd you get that? You think Lando Calrissian's Cal mother? I landed in this little planet and went to JC Penney's. Lando Calrissian's mother is a little kid. Like took him to like the JC Penney's. It on, does. On, it on, really uh, bothers me. Tatooine. I've never seen anybody in the Star Wars universe wear prints. Yeah. It's like, why don't they have a little Alex? Oh, they should have a little Rancor. There you on go. On their shirt, like a little ascot, or what is that? Uh, Ascot. Yeah. 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 All right. We got anyway, we got Joey this. from So Wizard Podcast. Yeah. Uh, in the last segment, uh, Joey, so wizard. Joey went down at the very end and lost against Mitch when we did a little bit of uh, Marvel Comics trivia. Um, I accused Joey of losing. If you get that joke, if you saw it, he lost on a Ronan the Accuser. Now, these guys are both Star Wars fans, extreme. I will put this out there. Mitch is like lives and breathes Star Wars. I have the goddamn job, the Hut sale barge for $500 in my dining room. Yeah, he, he, he bought the, the crowdfunded toy that is, it's the sale barge this big. Yeah. <laughs> Joey's a huge fan, but Joey has said that he's a little lapsed in terms of knowledge. I'm still so, a breathing fan. Like a I mean, Catholic. So yeah. we're, we're going to do we're gonna do the same thing. We're going to do three questions and out. I need yeah. my kids after Star Wars characters, so. I got a kid. Really? Oh, yeah. 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 You're, you, uh, well, Owen's a cool name, but like you, you went My wife did not know. She never watched Star Wars. She didn't know. Now, wh where are your kids' names come uh, from? They're middle names, so I have a oh. Colin Luke and a Janine Leia. Yeah, that's middle names, though. Yeah, yeah. no, but that's that like Come on, man. Yeah. My initials are MASH, all right? That's crazy. I purposely did the confirmation names to have Steven, so I'd have Mitchell, Anthony, Steven. Yeah, yeah you're a big so, MASH fan, So right? my name would be on TV across the world every night. That's <laughs> egomania. Yeah. <laughs> I always thought it was That's weird. Thoughts, I always dude. thought that you know, I, I know that Mash isn't like a feel good show, but like the fact Mash is the greatest show ever. Yeah, but the fact that the theme song to Mash is called Suicide, Suicide is, is Painless. painless. Yeah. That is just so heavy. It is, it man. Is such a it's heavy. so funny at the same time. Yeah, it's like this funny kind of show that gets like dark at times. Yeah. yeah. All right, let's start up with. Let's start, wow, really start that, with Joey. Up beat, okay. We're gonna start yeah. with Joey. Suicide. Oh boy. All right. Three questions and you're out. Yeah. And I am just gonna pick. There are categories on here. I don't know what they stand for, so I'm just gonna pick randomly. All right, Alex. All, All right. right. Does it have to be in the form of a question? My answer. Joey. Yes. What did R2D2 activate to cover his friend's escape to the Falcon in Cloud City? Choice. Nope, these are this is trivial pursuit, these are straight up answers. Remember. Mitch doesn't even know. I do. Oh you do know? Yeah, if he's done, I'll tell you yeah, what you can, you can take it. Hyper driver. No, no, no. Wait, his escape, his escape from to the Falcon. Falcon. When they're to in the, get to the Falcon. Inside the city. Oh, he opened the door. Oh, put the uh, the smoke screen on. The fire extinguisher. The fire extinguisher. Yeah, yeah. You are. You are a nerd. I thought you said to escape from Falcon. No, I, I, I made it a point to take the escape. He's not just a nerd. Because you said he is the king of the nerds. Did you, you hear that as Escape Cloud City? 
I thought that's what you said. I assumed you were talking about the hyper drive. We're going to start. Yeah. What did yeah. he activate? We're going to start Reason. another one. Actually, that's not true either because he opened the door, right. and then as the stormtrooper was coming, he put on a smoke screen right. to hide it. So Look, that has Mitch. That, contact the people bullshit. at Trooper Pursuit. <laughs> All right, I'm <laughs> reading. Give us right bullshit. Bullshit. That's bullshit. All right, we're gonna. Okay, right. Joey, we're back. That's the right. Temple right. Chad of Star Wars right, <laughs> right there. That's a false accusation. It's fake news. All right. Fake news. Exactly. <laughs> Joey, here's a, here's a softball for you. Oh boy, what controls a Jedi's actions? But also obeys his commands. The force. The force. Okay. Seriously. There we go. Seriously. That's the easiest. Mitch. One. Right. How many rivets are in the Star Wars? <laughs> what is Greedo's real name? Mitch. Yes. Who threw a landmine into an Imperial Walker during the Battle of Hoth? That would be Luke Skywalker. Luke Skywalker. Absolutely. All right. It's gonna be another long one. Right. Joey? Yeah. Pretty obscure character. Does it say like hard questions? No, they're just different categories, but I don't right, have the right, board right, with right. me, so I don't know. Okay. Yeah. Joey. Uh-huh. What gruesome looking creatures did Chewbacca tussle with to salvage C3PO's body parts? The Ugnaughts. Yes, yes, the uh Ugnaughts, Ug Huguenots, whatever it is. Mitch? Yeah. Let's put this one here. Alright. Who destroyed Darth Vader's wingmate in the Death Star's trench? Han Solo? Yes. Yes. All right. Joey? Uh-huh. What's the first film in the trilogy to find Luke calling Vader father face to face? Return of the Jedi. Yes. Mitch? Yeah. Who told Han the rescue reward would provide him with more wealth than he could imagine? Yes. Every time I think you don't know it, no, you're just I'm looking just at looking at like because I'm like, why are you insulting me with these <laughs> stupid questions? It's like, what's your name? Oh. Joey. Totally random. Uh -huh. Wink. What mercenary docked his ship on Cloud City's east platform? Boba Fett. Boba Fett. Right. All right. I hope you got a lot of film on that camera. Yeah. I got four hours. Okay. All right. All right. Mitch. Come on. Tough. Something tough. Yeah, How many star destroyers? Yeah. How many star destroyers attempted? To capture Hoth. the Falcon during its escape from Tatooine. Two. Three. Star Destroyers? Yes. When it blasted off from Tatooine? Yes. Looks like a Star Destroyer. There's two more coming at us. Okay, that would be three. Yes. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you don't, miss. I don't, I don't want to know. You know what it is? No, I, you don't see go. them. He says that. Because we had a Star Destroyer coming. It looks like our passengers are hotter than we thought. And that's one, and then you see on the screen only two coming at you. You never see a third one. So technically, how do you know that wasn't just two? All right, looks like a. We're Imperial gonna Star take the point. We're gonna we're gonna oh, knock no, it off. That's the dialogue. That's the looks like a period star story. Our passengers must be hotter than I thought. Angle a deflector shield to like make the jump to light speed. You want the goddamn dialogue? So My fuck God. those questions. <laughs> They're goddamn wrong. You see two. You want to hear the music? <laughs> That's the music that plays. I saw the movie 700 times, okay? okay. I'm thinking you did. I'm mad at I'm this. I'm thinking you did. You get right. me riled up. The blood pressure. All right. My mini chlorian right. count is through the roof right now. All right. All right. You're All right, saying he's right. Saying he's right. You're right. I'm wrong. Oh. Go ahead. I'm wrong. Give Joey the point. Well, no. You just lost no, the point. No, that's, that's fine. Go ahead. Doesn't anger lead to the dark side? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, Joey. Yeah. What did Han Solo think attacking the first Death Star was equivalent to? Suicide. It, that it was, was his question. That was my question. He's never going to get it because it goes back to that MASH thing, which you said Suicide Painless is a bad song, and then I'm losing it now because that answer was wrong. Mitch has completely lost it. Uh, <laughs> but you know what? I'm not giving up. I'm giving Joey another question. Joey, okay. another question. Give him a question. Give him a hard one. That's what's happening right now. Oh my god, a hard one. All right, you want a hard one? Sure. I'll give you one. What type of ship, Joey? Yeah was the shuttle Tiberium disguised as during transit to Endor. It's an Imperial shuttle, but what do you mean it was disguised as? What were they what were they pretending to be in terms of like I guess like what their ship purpose was? Oh. Wait a minute. I'm all set to go off on this one. Oh my god. 
I don't know, I think they were maybe a cargo ship? Cargo or? ship! Yeah. Yeah. Cargo Actually, ship. parts and technical crew for the Forest Moon. Forest Moon yeah. So, screw you. <laughs> Me and Chris are just stuck in the middle here. That's right. It's just I'm about to walk I mean, you got to make up your own answers? Fine, go All ahead. Right. Let's make them up. Hey, contact the folks at Classic Trivial Pursuit. I will. I will. I will. You do not call yourself Trivial Pursuit. There is going to be a strongly worded letter. Oh, yeah. Right. Apparently right. there is. If you're going to say that's the answer, make it right. <laughs> oh. They have the dialogue from the movies. I'm so it's nervous. Great for you. Oh, you should. All right, if you guys both get the next one right. It's a tie. It's a tie. Just, no? like, just no? like kissing your sister. Well, yeah, it's just, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Uh, 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 Mitch. Yes. What physicist did creature physicist? Listen. What? Oh. oh. What oh. physicist did creature designer Stuart Freeborn model? Albert Einstein. Nice. My my lord. And Joey. Oh boy. Who was the last to jump down the Death Star's garbage chute? I'm like replaying it in my head. Princess Leia? Han Solo! Oh, yeah, he dove. He That's dove right, get in there, you right? big furry oaf. Yeah. I don't care what you smell. I have right. to get in there. John to go, and uh, Joey, what color was Luke's lightsaber in Return of the Jedi? <laughs> well, we learned well, a couple things today. Is that I think Joey can hold his own in, in Star Wars trivia. And that these questions are full of crap. I think that these questions may be full of crap. <laughs> or at the, at the very least, Mitch uh, has seen Star Wars up to, uh, you really mean 700. How many laser cannons in a TIE fighter equipped with? Two. That's because why? So that's, an ion. No, that's for the engines, buddy. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we'll start. What type of character was Leia disguised as when she infiltrated Jabba's Bounty Pels? Hunter. And I know the name. What color is the yeah. planet Yavin as seen from space? Orange. Okay, yellowish orange, right? Or reddish. I was yeah. gonna say reddish. Uh, whatever. Or oh, whatever. Anyway, these these questions are full of crap. Well, <laughs> Piney Comics YouTube. Luke, told Luke you cannot hide forever. So is your podcast.com. That's right. Go to SoWizardPodcast.com. <laughs> Go see Mitch at TerrificCon.com, and I will challenge anybody to come to me with hard Star Wars questions. I don't think Amy wants to, I think that this is something people are going to be afraid of. Yeah, Let's do scary. Indiana Jones next, huh? Huh? Th that's your thing, right? That's right. Like, this is, like, Star Wars is your hobby and Indiana Jones is your thing? Never in a million years would I think anybody want to, uh, to, uh, what year did uh, Temple of Doom take place in? 1935. Yeah, forget it. Uh, Pine of Comics, we'll see you soon. So is the podcast. Bye. <laughs> All right, Pine of Comics here at BoomTube Comics, chilling out today. We got Jerry Ordway over there. It's an awesome day. But right now, a couple weeks ago, we were at uh, Plastic City Comic Con in uh, Leominster, right? It was Fitchburg. Fitchburg, uh, right? Fitchburg, Leominster. Uh, you know the donut, the donut capital of, uh, of Massachusetts. Is that true? Yeah, uh, I don't know, but there was. We have a video with them. There was a lot of donuts. Crazy with donuts. It was weird. But Mitch yeah. took on Joey from So Wizard in uh, in uh, Star Wars trivia. It was very controversial. There was a question here that Mitch didn't like, didn't agree with. So now you you do back I, off a little bit. I, yeah. I, 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 what is the word? Is with a C. Yeah, concede. 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 Thank you. I can see that my initial overreaction to the answer might have been a little misplaced. I would only watch Star Wars. I was convinced there was two Star Destroyers that pursued the Millennium Falcon when they escaped from Mos Eisley. The question and answer said three, but then thinking about it, why there was only two scenes on the actual film, they do reference a third off screen. So they were right, and I was. Not as he wasn't accurate. totally incorrect or right. <laughs> You'll have already yeah. seen that video prior to this yes, one. Yes, the video yes, will be yes, out yes, before this. You could see now that. Yeah. I am right in the fact you see only two, but you refer to a third one. So I guess. Yeah. Easy job. Six to one, half done to one of another. It is he still won. He, I he still won. Fair and square. Two times. You beat Joey at Marvel and Star Wars. So we're here today. We're here with Alex. I called out. I said, "Who here is a Star Wars fan?" Alex said, "Me." Uh, can you do well in trivia? He said, "Yes." He hasn't I didn't say that. Well, yeah, I know he didn't say that. He didn't say that. Well, well, didn't say that. Didn't say that. Was it two parts? Yeah. It just, yeah. Are you yeah. a Star Wars fan? Yeah, that yes. was pretty much it. Yes. Yes. He's good at trivia. Yeah. He did not answer. Okay. That. All right. So, so we're going to find out. Yeah. yeah. So standard rules apply if you've watched any of these. Uh, it's loud in here, so make sure to talk up with the answers. Um, I'm going to read a question off one of these cards to one of you, uh, and you answer it. And then once it's over, no stealing. New question to the next person. 
Now, first person who gets three questions wrong is done. Gets to eat another cold cheeseburger. No, yeah, gets to eat a cold cheeseburger out of the Burger King bag. But they're very good. We're probably going to put out anyways. Oh, I like that. I might right? only answer one correct question. Tom Ryan here, the, the fabulous artist, is going to keep track of wrong, right? That's Tom right now. <laughs> Tom, Check yeah. him out at Tom Ryan's studio. 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 Right? So, here's where we're going to start. We're going to start with Alex. Alex is a challenger. What a great... We're going to see how he does. All right. All right. Oh, my God. No, different book. Stranger different book. Stranger Things. Alex, for your first question, how many digits does Yoda have on each hand? Thumb counts as a digit, correct? Um, I will say yes. Okay. I believe Yoda has three on each hand. Yoda does have three. Correct. All right. Over to Mitch. And if we haven't mentioned, Mitch is the terrific, terrificness behind Terrificon, yep. which is coming up August uh, 9th through the 11th. It would it be on already by the time they see it? Oh, we'll, yeah. we'll get this out before. Yeah. Right. So you still have time to you either come down. Mohegan Sun. Yeah. Best yeah. show in Connecticut. It absolutely is. This year. Really, so. Yeah? Yeah? <laughs> All right. Let's see how good he is at Star Wars trivia. Um, what item of Chewbacca's? Did the Ewoks seize after capturing him? Bowcaster. His bowcaster is correct. All right. Back to Alex. <laughs> Who prevented Boba Fett from firing at Chewbacca in the carbon freeze chamber? Yeah. Was that Princess Leia disguised as another bounty hunter? No. No. Darth Vader. Darth Vader. Darth Vader. Darth Vader. One for Alex. Okay. All right. You know, oh, no. I know things. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. no, no Should I give no. him another one? Oh, wait. No, okay. I'll let it go. Vader does put down both Okay, yes, the, yeah, 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 okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. No that disintegration. Well, so that was earlier, though. Yeah, right? all right. Because okay. it was really Han that calmed Chewie down. But Vader was, did put his arm did, out. Yeah, right, I do right. remember that. Okay. We almost wow. had a repeat. Wow. <laughs> I'm so nervous. For a brief moment, I was like, wait a minute. My brain doesn't remember that. But then, yes. Mitch, yeah. I'm sure you have a nine-foot uh, toy of this at home. How many landing gear struts does an Imperial, Imperial shuttle have? Imperial shuttle have. Oh, a shuttle. Tidarium? Doesn't say, but I'm, I'm going to say three. Now, see, here's why I'm nervous. Because in my head, I'm thinking three, but it says two. I got I gotta go with Mitch on this one. I'm thinking no, no, three. No, 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 no. I'll just say it has two, and then the landing ramp is the middle thing. So maybe there was a third one. So yeah, hey, okay, I'll admit I'm wrong. Okay, all right. All right. See, look, a new Mitch. <laughs> Technically, I'm thinking, wouldn't the landing ramp count as a uh, as a footing? Yeah. No, no. Let's go with one each. Even footing, one each. Okay. Alex, I'm wrong. All right. All right. Who requested <laughs> that for the trip to Alderaan, there would be no questions asked? Ooh. I'm, this is going to be a shot in the dark for me. Trip to Alderaan, there will be no questions asked. And there's no clue giving in this no. trivia. There's nothing. No, but, but, to, but to, I guess, qualify a little bit, trip to Alderaan being... Is it two or three? No, it really is. He's right. The, the ramp counts as the third. Okay. All right. So, so that's. I okay. get that. I feel that. Okay. So so the, so the trip to Alderaan. Right. So they're 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 hiring Han trip to Alderaan. Yeah. yeah. Gotcha. All right. There's no questions asked. Ooh. It's probably too it's who hired. I'm spacing on who hires Han Solo. You, I know, yeah, I know. Oh. Can I answer that one, please, John? Son, hey. <laughs> we're going we're gonna to give Alex another second. Obi-Wan Kenobi. He gets oh, it correct! Oh, look at that. Look at that. See, it's the, it's the YouTube, it's the camera, it does things. It was, it was, yeah. I've, had, I've had the same, <laughs> I've had the same thing happen. I've had the same thing happen. All right, Mitch. Yeah. Mitchell. Yes. Anthony Steven, yes. <laughs> All right. Yes. What imperial what imperial vehicle did Ewoks bring down just as it was about to stomp one of their catapults? ATST, a chicken walker to the lame man. Yes, a scout walker to ATST is correct. All terrain scout is correct. All right. Alex. Yep. You got something hard in there. I'll give you something hard. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. oh easy. Let's see. 
wants to show me Who told Java C-3PO box. to shut up at the Jawa sale? I think I know this. That would be... I think it's Luke Skywalker. It is not. Mitch? Oh. Uncle Owen. Uncle Owen. All right, so two wrong to one. Yep. All right, let's see. Let me hang on by a thread. I'm hanging on by a thread. Okay. I think this might be hard. You probably have the action figure. Probably do. You probably have more than one. <laughs> what alliance general organized the ground assault on Endor? That would be Maydeen. Jesus Christ. You're wow. a nerd. You are the king of the nerds. Wow. So no... Crick's Maydeen, if you want to get specific. Yeah, oh, okay. I was thinking. Yeah, For the record, I do not feel bad about losing No, you should, yeah. Mitch. You should. I really don't. Worst hair piece in the entire Star Wars saga. You're right. Crick's Maydeen. I'm like, dude, what is on your head? <laughs> It's like, he moved this way, the hair moves that way. <laughs> All right. Really Alex, I think this one's doable. Many okay, we'll see. Died. We'll see. <laughs> what yep. world did Anakin Skywalker appear on after his death? So, Ghost Anakin. What world? He just told it. Well, after his death. Yeah, but there's not a lot of movies with Ghost Anakin in it. Go ahead. Remember, again, you got, you got two general meetings. That is a oh, softball toss. Go ahead. That, that is the planet that the Ewoks are on. And it's why am I? You just you just said it in a previous question. You just said it in a previous. I know you got it. It's true. I know you got it. I am mentally Actually, sending it to you. He does not have it because I'm going to argue about the answer you're going to give. Him. Oh, here we go. <laughs> I'm I'm I'm. I know why. Struggling with the name of the planet. It's the camera. Yeah, it is. It is. It, 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 I'm going to give him another question. Right, there's I, money I, involved. I'm going to give him another question, and I'm going to I'm, I'm going to say I already know what Mitch's argument is. Oh yes, is that it's not a planet, it's a moon. That's what you're going to say, right? It's the, the forest, forest moon, moon of Endor. Endor. Yeah. All right. Endor, Endor, Endor is the planet. Yeah, it's the forest the, moon of Endor. Yeah. yeah, but the moon isn't called with forest Ewoks. moon. Well, I always wondered that. Is it? Is Endor the planet, or is the moon I always the forest moon of Endor? Because at one point they called it the Sanctuary Moon, and I'm like, oh, is yeah. that its proper name? I've never really given it that much thought. I thought you know, but, you know, but, but honestly, you got a new question. Yeah. Because you got a new question. Is the I knew where it was at. Oh, you got the exact term. Which was Jupiter has but a I knew bunch where it was of moons. I feel okay about that. Ours is just called the moon. It's like, right. well, doesn't it have a name? Yeah, all the Jovian moons are like Io, Europa, Enceladus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So Endor, they should be called Endor. Alex, your, your, your do-over question. Sure. Whose face did Luke see inside Darth Vader's mask during his dark side vision on Dagobah? His own. Yes. I knew that, but I just wanted to see what it said. Because now I'm nervous about it. Why didn't you ask him, like, who struck back? Why didn't you ask him some really hard <laughs> Who ones? shot first? All right, you know what? Yeah, Go ahead. You want a tough one? You want a tough one, General Maybe? Come on. All right. All right. Yeah. You ready for this? Yeah. If he gets this right, I'm stopping this right now. Go ahead. Because Alex has no People chance. Will be okay. Hurt. No, sorry. What was the serial number of the stormtrooper whose armor Luke wore on the Death Star? The serial number. We might have gotten one he doesn't oh, no. know. Hold on a second. Princess was in uh, AA3. Don't mouth stuff to him. You probably no, know no, it too. No, 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 no. The, the serial number of This the is a bad question because I'm having a feeling like it's never referenced and he's going to go. Oh, shit. THX 1138. Why aren't you at your post? Oh, no. TK 421. Why aren't you at your post? TK 421. You make me physically sick. Holy shit. Wow. wow. Got it. Wow. That's him. Yeah. TK 421. Yeah, let's yep. give him one. TK 421. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. All right, Alex. Yeah, a lot of yeah. Poffins died to give you that answer. <laughs> I have no life. <laughs> All right. Who did C-3PO address when exclaiming, at least you're still in one piece, look what happened to me? R2-D2. Yeah. yeah. All right. Mitch? Yep. Uh, what do you complain about my question? You just answered one of the most <laughs> obscure questions I've ever heard asked in the history of questions. You know, oh, I think your next question yeah. is going to be, it's called the Millennium yeah. Y. Yeah. I'm clearly <laughs> sparring <laughs> above my weight class right now. What was the name of the right. town in the clouds? <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right, here we go. What question does Darth Vader, this is my favorite part with Mitch, where he starts reciting dialogue. It, it's, it's like Rain Man. It's awesome. What question does Darth Vader ask in his first line in Star Wars? What does Darth Vader ask? First line. His first line starts. What question does Darth Vader ask in his first line? What have you done with this? Fifty-two. Hold on! No! 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 
He's choking the guy. <laughs> what have you done with the plates? What plates? This is a diplomatic ship, but this is a diplomatic ship. Where is the ambassador? Commander now, what it says apart. here. Wait a minute. Wait, wait. <laughs> do you want the exact phrasing? Uh, what did I say? What does it say? <laughs> Where the, where the stolen transmissions are you intercepted? We intercepted no transmissions. Uh, you're right. You're right. This is a counselor ship. We're on a diplomatic mission. To Alderaan. To Alderaan. This is My answer is going to be how much wood could a woodchuck yeah. chuck? Yeah. Yeah. Wood chuck that was even what that was his first time. All right, Alex. Say. But that's what it was. What have you done? Okay. All right. Oh, this is the first card I have. Let me just move here a little bit. I actually try to get the dialogue in my head. Yeah. That's good. It's good. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine Raiders Lost Ark. We did that one. Oh, that'd be good. I, I know. Now, Mitch has. I got to find Indiana Jones trivia. Yeah, it's, sure they it's like it's really like, they don't yeah, have like a. Yeah, yeah it's, so. it's it's tough. I could do that whole movie. I'll have to find it. What body part did Luke slice off the Wampa before escaping its lair? He. I think he did. He, did he take an arm? Takes an arm. They always take an arm. It's every, an arm. every, every movie, right? Yeah, Someone yeah, loses yeah, yeah, an arm. Hand or arm. Hand or arm. There were a couple of arms in that movie. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. All right. What ugly aliens, Mitch, did the actor Jack Purvis oh, play the chief on? Yeah. Ugna. Yeah. 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 yeah, he was awesome. Ugna. Yeah, yeah. Ugna. All right. <sighs> Who blocked Luke's lightsaber swing at the Emperor? I. That would be Darth Vader. Darth Vader. Yep, I'm sorry, man. We got another one, man. We can't find someone that can just go right down. I get Alex. Like, that's all the credit in the world to you. Yeah, sure. I get. What is the toilet that they use? To <laughs> <Yeah>. Well, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, keep these coming. This yeah, is great. Fine, you know. What is the name of ice cream maker guy? Yeah. yeah. Oh, that would be good. Yeah. Will Rohut. Will, yeah. That's right. Because I think I've heard ice cream. <laughs> oh, ice cream maker guy. Yeah, ice cream maker Will guy. Will, Will Rohut. Will Rohut. Yeah. But uh, to the best of my knowledge, I don't think he was ever actually named in the movies. I think no, the fans gave No, him but they idea. made him a figure I think, I last year, right? Yeah. yeah. That's a peg warmer. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah. What device yeah. do Y-Wing and X-Wing pilots use to help them plot torpedo runs? No, oh, oh, oh. That's the thing. It's it's in it, here, mind you. No, no, Call no. Call the targeting just, computer. Oh, uh, whatever. Call the targeting computer. So where are we at? We made a mistake. Tied two two. Tied two two. Next question now. Oh, you have a chance of winning. Well, was, I don't. I doubt that. Doubt that very much. Targeting computer. What was Job of the Hutt's <laughs> posted reward for Chewbacca's capture? Okay. I may have the number. I will I have to say the currency too? No, no. Okay. Just the number? Number. I want to say. There's two numbers rolling around my brain. Give me both, and if you get either one, okay. It's both. Yeah. Two numbers in my brain. Either it would either be a hundred thousand or two mil or two million. No. What was it? Three. No. Six. No. Twenty-seven point three. Twenty-five thousand. Twenty-five thousand. Twenty-five thousand. So Alex, okay. right? You played a man's game. I tried. Did my best. I, I don't know if there's anybody in here that thinks they can take this guy on. Mitch. Yes. Good game. Oh yes. Thank you. Yes. Pleasure. So no, check I, in for usual. Do argue with their answers. Yeah. Hey, look. <laughs> hey, look. This ain't us. Party. So this is a. Uh, I don't know. Trivial pursuit. Uh, classic. There. You you go through it. And you find the ones you hate the most. <laughs>